Good morning, good morning. <laughs> we have had some fun this morning. Um, don't want to tell you about all of it, but happy birthday. Welcome to the first day of the rest of your life. Isn't that a wonderful time to be alive? <laughs> Every day is your birthday if you choose to celebrate life, and why wouldn't you want a surprise? Surprise? Celebrate life? Celebrate life. Um, when you are watching me today, this morning, Saturday morning, um, in this beautiful garden, oh, beautiful garden, beautiful field, <laughs> um, with a nice cup of coffee. Unfortunately, not from Rave, because Rave is closed today, um, so I didn't even find out the names of the girls who normally serve me in Rave, uh, so I had to go to Jesse's, and the coffee's okay. I think it's actually still Rave coffee, but... Yeah, they've uh, they've ground it too small, and uh, and it's it's a little bit a little bit burnt. <laughs> it's all about the coffee. I used to be, I used to be a Costa Coffee um, barista. In fact, I used to train people how to do Costa Coffee because um, <laughs> I used to own a Costa Coffee. Um, hello, Varya, by the way, just popped up a message from you, so I want to say hello to you. I've had a lovely conversation with Varya this morning, um, which has been fun because we were supposed to speak on the video yesterday we never got a chance to though so and then she's busy busy today so uh, and also emma hammond who i've been speaking to this morning as well uh, it's nice to see you back online as well um yes yeah, so i used to own a costa coffee um kind of franchise i guess inside the children's play center that i used to own in 2006 um that i started up um built uh, and then led to my financial downfall in 2007 <laughs> anyway enough about me um Welcome to the happy birthday. Welcome to the first day of the rest of your life. Happy birthday. No, we're going to talk about um, baby steps versus slowing down in a moment. But um, uh, first of all, happy birthday to um, uh, Nithalan. Nith Nithalan. Yeah, Nithalan. That's right. Um, hello. Good morning, viewer, by the way. Let me know who you are so I can see who you are and make a comment if you can. That'd be fantastic. Tell me what you're watching from. Actually, anybody who's watching, tell me where you're watching from, what you're doing today, what you're up for the weekend. Um, and what your one thing is that you're going to get done today. We're going to come on to that in a second. Renee, happy birthday to you. Uh, Rob Breyer, happy birthday to you. Chloe Louisa Pearson, happy birthday to you too. I hope, you, hope you're getting a chance to do some skydiving. I'm lovely, really looking forward to doing some skydiving with you one day. I've never done skydiving, I would love to go. Um, eventually, it's, on my, it's definitely on my bucket list, no question about it. In fact, I had a friend, Scott, uh, and he and I were, 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 were planning to go over to Florida many years ago to learn how to skydive. Um, and uh, I don't know, for some reason it just never happened. Not sure why. Um, do like an intensive um, seven day or 14 days, I'm not sure how long it was, to, uh, to learn uh, how to do solo skydiving in like a, a week or whatever, one just on holiday. Um, so yeah, there you go, there's a holiday for you. Uh, Linda Shaw, happy birthday to you. Bose Durston as well, Durston? Durston, yes, Durston, who lives just around here somewhere uh, in Cotswolds. Um, so happy birthday to you. And Veronica, of course, Veronica from my CD, CDC days. It was CDC, wasn't it? CDC and Liquent. Not sure whether you were a liquid or CDC, I can't remember. Um, anyway, those days, um, lovely days, lovely, lovely memories from, uh, uh, from Cancun in Mexico with you, Veronica. Um, lovely to catch up at some point. Um, anyway, hope you're well. Uh, married life is treating you well. <laughs> um, I think you've got babies now as well, haven't you? I think. Not sure. Anyway. Um, cool. Anyway, happy birthday to all of you people. Breathing exercise, first of all. Breathe out. Five in through the nose. Hand on heart. Put the coffee down. Holding for five. <laughs> Hold for five. Light your candles. Blow your candles out on your cake. Wish yourself a happy birthday. Wish all the other people happy birthdays. Hello, viewer. You're back again, whoever you are. It's fantastic to see you. Um, uh, yes, so um, baby steps versus... <laughs> Good morning, there's somebody who wants me to walk past us, so you're going to enjoy my little, my little live for a second. Hello, good morning, how are you doing? Some people tell you to slow down, and you shouldn't slow down. <laughs> you can slow down, depends on the circumstances. Obviously, that lady there walking past, for example, um, is having a little slow moment walking in nature, which is a great thing to do. Um, this is more about uh, business, um, in a business style, don't slow down, um, don't, uh, you know, sp uh, quit speed. Uh, money loves speed, that's what it is. Money loves speed, that's the thing on there. And you'll know, if you've been watching me for any length of time, one of the reasons why I'm not getting paid is because I haven't got that damn landing page done, have I? Still haven't got it done. And last week I spoke to a lady, Jackie. Um, if you remember, on, on the live last week, I did an extra long one. I was talking to a lady called Jackie, um, who gave me all these ideas about how to uh, set up uh, my Facebook page so that people were coming into my Facebook group. If you want to join the Facebook group, by the way, um, <laughs> uh, uh, facebook.com, obviously groups. Uh, forward slash find your fire community is what it's called find your fire community uh, come and join us in there um, hopefully at some point 
uh, I'm going to start doing these videos in the group uh, so then I can see more statistics on it and then it'll just be for the people in the group and then I'll be pushing these uh, little ones out. I might do the little birthday things uh, every day anyway uh, for people and maybe like a little sort of mini overview of, of something, some topic. Um, maybe sort of an introduction and say, go and join the group. We're going to do the rest of the conversation is going to be in the group, something like that. Uh, might be kind of fun. We'll see. We'll see how that works. Um, anyway, but I didn't do all the things that she told me to do. And she was uh, beating me up. Hello, Craig. Thank you for watching, by the way. I could see who that was, for, which, is, which is nice. Mm. So yeah, I didn't do the things that she wanted me to do. Uh, and she beat me up a little bit for it on, in, in Messenger the other day. And she's quite right to do so, by the way. Um, so, so uh, yeah, so I need to crack on with that today. Um, I just have this fear. Well, you, you know, because we've been watching my videos this week um, about my uh, rejection uh, sensitive dysmor dysmorphia, um, which I've been exploring this week and trying to work it out. Um, it's been quite a journey this week trying to figure that out and trying to work out what's going on with it. Um, just notice this camera is a little bit blurry. So hold on just a second. I'm just going to clean that up. There we go. That's a bit better. Um, anyway, um, <laughs> baby steps versus slowing down. What I really wanted to say, though, is if you're struggling with depression and anxiety, or depression mostly, that's what I'm both really focusing on now, uh, which is obviously what I teach people, um, then sometimes those baby steps is what's actually needed. You can do them fast, uh, you can do them quick, and in business, obviously, you want to take, you want to, you want to do the things, but you've got to do the baby steps. So you've got to do the first steps. You've got to, you've got to take the first step to get to the second step. Um, you've got to, you've got to get through your, what? It, uh, okay, so <laughs> I also hear people talking about. Uh, how to get to your £10,000 a month uh, income. And you go, great, that's great, <laughs> but you've got to go through uh, a £1,000 a month income level first. Um, now, you can speed that up, obviously. You don't actually have to have done a month at £1,000 and then done a month at £2,000 and then done a month at £4,000. It doesn't have to take that long. Um, you could get there really quickly, but you have to go through the process of whatever it is uh, that you need to do to be able to earn £1,000 £1,000. Um, before you can get to beyond that. Unless, of course, you just go out and say, find somebody who's gonna pay you 10,000 pounds in month one, fantastic. But then you also have to find that single person month two as well. And have you got a process for that? Was it lucky? Will you be able to find somebody else who's willing to pay you that sort of money? And then what about month three? Um, okay, so you managed to get two for two, but could you do it until month three? Have you got the processes in place to be able to consistently do that 10,000 pound months? Um, etc etc so have you put the baby steps in have you put the work in have you put the effort in um, and obviously when i start talking about depression um, it becomes what's the little things what are the little things that you can do to prove to yourself that you can achieve the goal that you're trying to achieve um, and then do them and then prove to yourself you can do them feel good about having 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 done them um, and somebody walking across now i'm gonna step out of the way because <laughs> otherwise i'm gonna disturb people um sorry yeah just chatting online. <laughs> um, so yeah, um, that's uh, yes, yeah. I'm, I'm, I'm not going to stand there again. I don't think it's uh, it's too distracting for other people. And I can I can stand over there, which is where I was last time. Just over there. <laughs> um, I don't think people will look at me quite so weirdly uh, from from doing uh, making these these little videos. But it's a bit muddy. I'll show you the bit muddy. A bit muddy. It's a bit muddy. <laughs> uh, and obviously this is a horse field. Where the horses? Horses are up there. Anyway, um, uh, what was I saying? Um, baby steps. What are the baby steps you need to be taking to prove to yourself that you can do them and therefore you can, you can achieve your goals and make, make progress, make progress towards where you need to get to. Um, so that's an important thing is to be able to do that and make the decisions. Somebody else coming past now as well, if I look at it. Of course, there's a dog. <laughs> um, there's a dog. I don't know where the dog went. There's a dog. Anyway, um, Cool. Anyway, I think that's probably all I wanted to say now. Um, oh, yeah. That, no, oh, sorry. The, the, the other comments that's in the notes below is uh, long-term consistency beats short-term intensity. So that, that's, which is exactly what I was saying with that £10,000 a month. You, you can get one £10,000 month. Absolutely. Um, uh, but can you consistently do it? Um, and you're almost better off doing better, 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 <laughs> better off doing um, a regular um, like two thousand pound months, rather than like one off ten thousand pound months, for example, because you might get one ten thousand pound month, and you might not get another one for six months, for example. Uh, and in the meantime, if you did two thousand, two thousand, two thousand, oh hello. <laughs> Having said, if I stood down there, I wouldn't be in the way of anybody. <laughs> Here comes somebody coming up that way as well. It's all fine. <laughs> oh, have they? Yeah, they're sitting in this bit. Ah. 
different horses, are they? Oh. Um, oh. No, no, different. Yeah, some of them are a little bit flighty at the moment. Oh, okay. <laughs> Good luck. <laughs> um, anyway, <laughs> there you go. A little insight into uh, random people on the walk. <laughs> um, I don't know if she was having a go at me, I'm not sure. It's one of those sort of things where you're not quite sure who's in the right and who's in the wrong. So she might have been thinking, oh God, I'm in trouble because he's <laughs> he's out here on the walk <laughs> and she's giving me an excuse as to the horses. Uh, whereas I might be thinking to myself, oh, maybe they're her, her. I was thinking to myself, maybe they're her horses and uh, I'm intruding and I'm um, uh, uh, trespassing. <laughs> Who knows? <laughs> anyway, there you go. Um, <laughs> Uh, what was I saying? Oh, long-term consistency uh, beats short-term intensity. So yeah, you're in really intensive, getting really so. So these people who do like these hundred thousand pound launches, it's all fantastic, great. Uh, but how often can you do that? Um, and how much work is involved in doing that? And how much do you build up to it? I, I mean, okay. So if you did hundred thousand pound launch once a year, then you're earning hundred thousand pounds a year, aren't you? So that's kind of okay. Um, it depends on what your costs are, though, doesn't it? Because uh, sometimes you'll find that those people who do the £100,000 launch has actually spent £50,000 on advertising and effort and outsourcing and all that kind of stuff. Who knows? Who knows what their behind the scenes are? It's all very well. You could even say that somebody made uh, a 50... I mean, I did on my um, my event in 2014. Um, I did a... Uh, I made... What did I make? £3,000, I think, or something like that. But it cost me £8,000. So that's not a very good business model, is it? <laughs> um uh, so yeah, uh, it's not it's not always very good. This one has been a bit of a random all over the place video today, hasn't it? <laughs> anyway, the point I'm making, the really key point of this though, is that um, consistency, long-term consistency, that's effort over time. So when I always I always talk about becoming ace, the three things ace, A C E, um, <laughs> um, which is uh, being aware of the issue that you're trying to deal with. Um, making some changes and choices uh, to change and then putting the effort in over time and it's the effort in over time that allows you to rewire the the um, uh, the uh, neural pathways in your mind um, to allow you to embed the new changes and the new feelings so that they become new habits um, and um, don't uh, you don't fall back into the old habits. That's the classic. Um, I always talk about this about the uh, the pathways um, through the well through the mud. You can see it again. Same thing here, isn't it? The mud, um, the, the easy path. Where's the, where's the easy? Well, actually, it's an interesting interesting situation here, isn't it? Because where's the where's the easy path here? It's clearly not through the mud, is it? <laughs> the easy path would be over here somewhere, where it's uh, sort of nice solid grasses. What's the easy path through over here? Here's the easy path, isn't it? <laughs> Is this an easy path? Not so much. Uh, that's definitely an easy path. Is it an easy path in there? Well, actually, yes, because there's another path inside there. But normally you would say no. Um, actually, if you're in the heart, in the path here, there you go. So there's um, uh, so there's the easy path. And then down there, there's a little river, which is definitely not the easy path, is it? You could go down to the river, look, and you could walk along the river if you wanted to. But it wouldn't be the easy path. Here would be the easy path. <laughs> um, and obviously you could change it. You change it so that the river was the easy path if you wanted to. Um, if you wanted to build something there and make that into your new pathway the way you want to go, um, and then that would be the way to go. Anyway, there you go. I'm coming up on 15 minutes now, which I never intended to do with this one. Um, it's supposed to be a short one, but uh, there you go. It is life, isn't it? Um, so yeah, if you're struggling with something like depression, baby steps is the way to go. If you're, if you're building a business, fast is the way to go. <laughs> Still do the steps. Still do the, 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 the in-between bits, but do them fast. Uh, take action quickly, which is what I haven't been doing, which is what I need to go and do right now. That damn landing page, that Facebook profile for Jackie, um, <laughs> and uh, and crack on so that people can actually pay me some money if they want to pay me money. There are people out there who are asking me, how do I work with you? What can I get, get buy from you? They're not actually asking what they can buy from me, but um, they're effectively saying that by engaging with me. Um, and I'm saying, mm, nothing really. <laughs> I can send you some free stuff, but I haven't got any way of paying me really. So i um, definitely working on that. Oh, sorry, I didn't mean to pick that up just yet because I needed to do this and this and then do this. And I'll send you love out into the world and I uh, hope you have a lovely weekend and I'll see you on Monday with some more tip bits and hopefully with the landing pages sorted out and my Facebook profile sorted out. That's the plan this weekend. What's your plan for this weekend? What's your one thing you want to get done this weekend? And watch Eurovision Song Contest on Saturday night? <laughs> Who's going to win? Who knows? I'll let you know on Monday. Bye for now.